Hey guys, so see you bringing you another video and welcome back to another loot video. Now before we get into it, I just thought I'd show uh, the store because uh, a lot of people I've seen in the comments going, Huz, what did you get on your main account store? So here's all the skins. Again, we own a lot of the skins, so I generally don't get like a lot of good stuff. And you have to remember that even though we may go very slowly for every single skin in the game, it doesn't mean I'm going to buy individual ones. Like a lot of people say, oh, the these two are really good. So Lux... Well, there's Elementalist, which is better, and then Warwick. Well, I've got Earthwick and Grey Warwick, which is which are just rarer. So I just will say that straight away. Um, but yeah, let's open some stuff. So we're going to do more of the pirate looting. Um, so we're going to do more of these today, which again, very expensive. But last time it was definitely worth the value. Um, but we're going to buy another 7,500. And that does leave a little bit of riot points left over if we wanted to buy two more of these if we weren't quite happy with what we've got. Uh, so we'll say, obviously, last video, it did fairly well. And you guys definitely liked it. And that's why I'm doing another one. Again, these videos are very expensive to make uh, in comparison to, let's say, a commentary or a league discussion. So if you want me to do another one of these, I will say we, were, we are going to put some goals in this video. Firstly, a thousand likes is going to be a minimum for another episode. And I actually am, for the first time ever, probably going to do a view goal. That This video will probably have to hit minimum thirteen to 14,000 views in order for me to want to do another one. So I will just say that right now going into it. But let's begin. So we did buy them. Um, so let's firstly begin with the Golden Kraken that obviously we got uh, in buying the bundle. Um, so here we go. Let's open this first because this is like the piece de resistance. Get cap, um, Cut Purse Twisted Fate, Primal Udyr, Surprise Party Fiddle, which is legendary, and Dark Star Thresh, which is another legendary. We were given Dark Star Thresh, and I presume we already own, we do already own Surprise Party. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's open 10 more. First one, uh, Chemtech Trindamir, Surprise Party of Mumu, Corporate Mundo Legendary, Gemstone. If you remember last episode, if you haven't watched it, it'll be linked at the end. I won't spoil that one too much, but we did unlock a Hextech skin in that. So feel free to go back and watch the other one. Next uh, little one here, definitely not Velkos, also known as Steve, King Trindamir, Arcade Ezreal, and 225 Orange. Again, all re-rolls, etc. will be done at the end of the video. Uh, Midnight Ari, Bullet Angel Kaiser, Glacial Olaf, and more uh, Orange Essence. Again, look at the amount of Orange Essence we have. Again, this is where I say the, the weird thing with these skin shards is I can always just buy whatever skin shards that, you know, we may or may not have. Uh, Nightmare Chogath, we've got the um, whatever one for Varus. Arcade Sona, and 225. Six more to go. Sand Scourge Skarna, definitely not Udyr. Risen Fiddlesticks, and another Gemstone, so we're already back to two, and 225, so that's nice. Again, just to remind everybody, we do own all of them apart from the Annie, so that's probably what we'll go for next, unless by the time we get to 10 Gemstones again, they may announce another Gemstone skin. I, I doubt it, because Alistair didn't actually come out that long ago, but yeah. Uh, Academy Echo, Snow Day Singed, Death Swarm Katarina, and 225. Well, actually saying that, they do, what, two a year? So it came out like two odd years ago. We got Annie straight away. Then after Annie, I can't remember what was after Annie. Was it Darius? Or no, it was then Vayne. And then it was Darius. Then it was Hecarim. Then it was Cogmore. Then it was Alistair, I think. So there might be another one at the end of this year. Possibly. We also got a chest, I think. Possibly. Uh, Mecha Aatrox. Hextech Anivia. Godfist Lee Sin. Obviously already own it. And 225 Orange. Keep her going. Headless Hecarim. Uh, Sweetheart Rakan, Apocalyptic Brand, and more orange. Two more to go. Uh, Frank and Tibbers Annie, Dragon Trainer Lulu, Project Vi, and 225 orange. And our final one is no bonus loot. Void Fizz, World Breaker Nautilus, Dragon Sorcerer Zyra, and 225. We'll just actually make the point once again. So in the 10. Uh, of these that we've opened in total, we have not once been given a golden kraken in those loot boxes or the other one. So the only time that we've ever got a golden kraken or a uh, blood harbor medallion is when we bought one of these bundles or we bought this one. That's pretty bad. Like, you know, we haven't had one of those randomly. So that, that is just something to point out. We'll open this as well, because why not? And we get... Lollipoppy. Okay, so quite a lot to do uh, in re-rolling. Let's just do what we did last time and just see like what do we own, what do not we don't own, and I might just unlock a couple. Um, but just to make it clear, before we begin, 
we did just get one skin, I think, at least, which was, yeah, Dark Star Thresh. So before this video, we had 707 skins. So we can just kind of keep a mental count of how many skins we'd have. But also just to make the point that I mentioned last time is that we did get some legendary skin shards. Well, obviously, we may have been given those to unlock permanently, which does add to the value of this. But because we already own them, it makes it appear that we're not gaining that much. But to you guys at home, if you own less, you would have gained those skins as well. So let's go through it. Uh, Academy Echo, we got it. Apocalypse, we got it. Arcade Ezra, got it. Arcade Sona, got it. Twist Effect, got it. Corporate Mundo. Trindamere. If you're wondering where am I seeing, if you look at the top of their little thumbnail, it says owned. So I'm just seeing what we do not own. So we don't own that. That could be impossible. Um, I'm just seeing if like there's anything that I want. Um... And we might, we might get that Katarina one. But again, I do have some nice Katarina ones. I've got like the football one, which I presume will come back in the World Cup. So Fiddlesticks one, but I got Union Jack. See, like this is the problem is I, I do own, um, in my opinion, better versions of th these things. I don't think I'm going to unlock any of them. I think we're just going to go for a pure reroll fest. Let's do it. Boom. Oh, well, there we are. <laughs> That, that's kind of funny. So I was thinking about un unlocking the Katarina skin and we just get given it anyway. That's actually hilarious. Uh, so we'll say people may get triggered. We are just going to re-roll uh, the, all the epic skins, all the legendary skins. I know to a lot of people that isn't worth it. But just again, just remind everybody, I have like a grey beard. Nice. I have over 15,000 orange essence. I don't need any more orange essence because if I wanted to unlock this legendary Mundo skin, it costs 1,500. I've got 15,000. So I, I'm never going to need orange essence more than I've got now. So we're just going to re-roll it all and just get more skins. Because why not? Warden Jacks. Yeah, it's a pretty nice Jack skin, but obviously I've got Pax Jacks, so I'll never use it. Uh, Keeper, go on. Mistletoe LeBlanc. Surprised I don't actually have that, to be honest. Because that's a relatively old skin. Ionia, Master Yi. That will never see the light of day. Um, I, I Again, part of me just hopes that one day I'll get like the Annie skin. Like the Hextech Annie in like a reroll. It, it is possible. People tweet to me when they do it. Uh, and I know it's possible, but yeah. See, Hunter Aatrox, obviously, nice skin for him. Samurai Yi. Okay, Riot is telling me something by the looks of it, because why does it want me to play Yi? Nobody knows. Uh. Oh, wait. Let's open a box. Paul Party Zack. Do I own that? Yes. Okay, I own it. Okay. Okay, let's keep going. And I will say there have been some comments in the in the another chest. There have been some people going, oh man, he got that skin and just acted like it's nothing. I, I never mean to come across that way, but I will just say when you own most stuff, it's like, you know, yay. Um Oh, that's nice. Um so yeah, I, I apologize if ever I come across like that. I don't mean to be, it's just yeah. Alright, we'll open this chest and <laughs> What's in the box? Another box. Dragon Trainer Tristana Legendary. Um, so we'll open it again. Boxes on a box. And we get Cogmore Champion. Okay. Do we own the Tristana? We do. And again, just to remind everybody. I'm, again, I'm not entirely sure how it works perfectly. But we may have just been given that Legendary skin. Uh, but because we already own it, we're not given it. So just to make that point. Okay. So next. Cosmic... What the hell? We have been given three Master Yi skins. That, honestly, that's a really nice skin, so great. If I get him in ARAM, that's probably the one I'll use. But, like, whoa. Three Yi skins. I won't play Yi, Riot. Stop. Leave it out of it. 100 and Vandal Brand. Ugh. And we got how many? We got three. We've literally got uh, two more rerolls perfectly that fit together. Cool. And we get. Star Guardian Syndra. Okay, I didn't own it. I like Syndra. And then our final reroll of this video is... And the survey says... Nope, we get a box. Commando Lux. Okay, we'll never use that. God, we've been... Honestly, we've been given a pretty good amount of value uh, with, with all the chests and the rerolls. Not bad. Um, so there we go. That is all that we get today. 
Nothing fantastic, but that's just, it's going to go that way sometimes. Again, this is basically gambling. Uh, but we get two more gemstones. We get a decent amount of champion shards. Again, if, if you weren't me and you didn't own everything, it would be useful. You know, you know, these champion shards may be good to you. They're not to me. All the skin stuff. So again, we had 707. We now have 720. So we gained 13 skins by uh, the bundle. So 7,500 riot points, which is about 45 pounds, is 45 pounds worth 13 skins. Kinda, but again, like I mentioned earlier, is that it's a bit weird with me because obviously I own all the legendaries that it was giving me and you'd automatically get those where I didn't. So it does increase the value, just not to me personally. Uh, but yeah, the skins that we got, just a bit of a run through. Dark Star Thresh, uh, Death Swan Katarina, Viga Greybeard, Warden Jax, uh, my, Mi Mistletoe LeBlanc, Ionia Master Yi, uh, Sea Hunter Aatrox, Samurai Yi, uh, Dragon Blade Riven, Cosmic Blade Master Yi, <laughs> Vandal Brand, Star Guardian Syndra, and Commando Luck. So that is it. So we've got 720 skins. Uh, if you're wondering how many skins are roughly in the game of League of Legends, it's about 870, roughly. Um, so we're, we're closing in uh on it I, d I don't know if i'll ever get there i'm gonna be honest i don't really have like i don't have the drive to get there because it doesn't give you anything it's basically just like look how much money i wasted um but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this video again just to mention if you want me to do another episode of this then throw a like on it we need to have a minimum of a thousand likes and around 13 roughly thousand views and i'll do another one so that'll be it like subscribe see you guys next time